We are in car eight. This is the wrong Dex, but no. still a Dex. It's the right Dex? This is the right Dex. How is this supposed to be the wrong Dex? You said it wasn't the same Dex. We have to go to Spokane. And then go down to Spokane. Okay, well I'm not going to Spokane. I'm going to this Dex. Alright, let's see what we got in here. Surprise. You want to get a more fries. There's my deluxe. A little tiny little spray. Oh, <laughs> 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 So Swedish. It's somewhere around here. It's where my little brother was born. Yeah. This is legitimately the smallest soda I've ever drunk from. They have the little half soda cans. So this is a weird thing I saw online. It is a soda machine that's just sitting out on the road. Oh, it's a dollar. Anyway, the mystery. And I'm just trying to find if I have enough change. I don't have enough change. This is take two. We had to stop at the Rite Aid to get change because the price increased to a dollar a can now. But there's this magic soda machine. Mystery soda machine. It's just sitting here by this locksmith. Put money in there, and then you get a soda, and you don't know which one you get. Let's see what we got. Dr. Pepper with cherry. Woo! Nifty. Let's try to Ooh, do the bottom right one. Mountain Dew, some Mountain Dew. White Dewey. Oak. Yay! Woo! We got mystery soda. What did you get? Mm. Hello. Wow. So it is a Nico espresso soda. What does Nico mean? Orange, cinnamon, and vanilla. Oh, is yeah. it good? Yeah. It's amazing. Isn't it?
right. stepped out to uh, go to the bathroom real quick so I'll do a, a quick tour of our Amtrak Superliner roomette um, in the room across the hall right now but there it is in all its glory We've got a couple chairs one for Brian one for me folds down right there into the bottom bunk top bunks up there that comes down Let's see what we got controls here, a little reading lamp, that's bright, uh, call button, and room lights, change that to blue, off, on. On the side we've got another reading lamp, temperature control, and the one outlet, but thankfully we've got a little travel power strip. We've got here coat hangers. closet. Barely enough room for both of our coats, but towels are up there. Uh, showers downstairs. And that's really about it. Oh, there's a little trash can. All of our rubbish. And bags go on this little step ladder to get up to the top bunk. It's a little tight, but it's cozy. And there's our giant window. Not much to see, but that'll change soon. Okay, so there's a little tiny town in France. They changed their name to Churchill because the English made this gigantic floating concrete structure that they rammed into the beaches in France and it was an offloading dock so they could dock Liberty ships. They had three of them. There was a huge storm. Two of them came loose and the other one got damaged, but it was still functional and then they got more there. But it was basically, they docked a shipyard onto the beach. All those.